Ozempic face, it's been all over the news and social media. Ozempic, it is literally the hottest drug. It's a miracle. It's too good to be true. People like to think I took the easy way out. It's really frustrating to me. Is it an unusual side effect of Ozempic and is there something you can do to avoid it? Today, I'll be sharing with you the science behind it. And if you're new here, my name is Khalid. I'm a family doctor working in London. Let's dive straight in. Now, Ozempic, also known as semaglutide, is a medication used in type 2 diabetes. It works by mimicking the effect of a hormone called GLP-1 in your body and that basically helps regulate your blood sugars and it can also help you lose weight. Wigovi is the same medication but a version of it made for non-diabetics and it's there to help weight loss. Now people who have been taking a Zembic have reported some unusual symptoms. They describe a hollowed out appearance of their face, uh, more wrinkles and lines across their face making them look older, and loose, saggy skin. But the so-called azempic face, is it exactly a side effect of the drug? Well, not in a technical way. You see, anyone who has a massive weight loss quickly can have some of these features. And that's irrespective if you're using azempic, Wigovi, any other weight loss drug, or you've lost weight quickly yourself. You may know friends or family who have lost that kind of weight, and what happens? Well, they have lots of saggy skin. So what is a zombic face? Well, this phenomenon is a uh, result of excessive weight loss. When you lose weight, you start to lose the stores of fat around your body. So the classic places we know about fat is your belly fat, but you also have fat in like other parts of your body. Your visceral fat is fat around your vital organs. You can also get fat across your face and that gives you your natural aesthetic. When we lose weight quickly, our skin hasn't had enough time to adjust to those body changes. So this may cause loosening of skin, sag skin, especially in areas where there's lots of fat or muscle before the weight loss. The elasticity of your skin is largely determined by collagen and elastin fibers in the skin. And also collagen provides this kind of structural support for your skin, while elastin allows it to stretch and bounce back into place. And so when we gain weight, the skin stretches out to accommodate the additional fat and tissue and collagen and elastin fibers may become damaged or degraded over time. And this may make the skin less able to retract after weight loss, resulting in loose, saggy skin. But it's not a simple formula that if you are overweight, eventually when you lose the weight you're going to get loose skin. You see there are lots of factors for our skin stretching ability, age, genetics, um, ethnicity, um, the amount of weight loss, the speed at which you've lost the weight and also your general health. Older adults may have less elastic skin and those who lose a large amount of weight quickly are more likely to experience loose skin than those who lose weight gradually. One important caveat is that there are also non-prescribed use of the drug for lots of people since it's a approval in the US for example, we go V for weight loss and unfortunately we've also seen the rise of like celebrities using it like everybody's favorite billionaire who's so relatable. And lots of people have jumped on the bandwagon without thinking about how it should be used, the side effects, making sure it's under professional monitoring. If a Zempic is prescribed by a healthcare professional, we normally monitor the dosing and regulate it. The aim would be to have a sustained weight loss, but avoid dramatic weight loss that can impact the fat in your face. This way you avoid getting loose, saggy skin across the face and that classic Zempic face. And so it's important to have a modest plan to lose weight and give the skin more time to adjust to the changes of your body size and shape and also to do some strengthening exercises can also help build muscle mass and improve overall firmness and the tone of your skin but the important takeaway that i would like you to know about this is both for Zempic and Wegovy, these are drugs that can help with weight loss, but it's so important to make sure you have lifestyle changes that go with it. So healthy diet, exercise, and it's not for an easy go-to option that you can take before a wedding or a holiday or a special event. You have to have a balanced plan and monitoring to help you get the best outcomes. And if you just use it for a quick fix or weight loss, as soon as you stop using it, the weight loss can bounce back. Click on this next video in which I explain exactly how Zempic and Wegovy works and why you you might gain weight once you stop using it. As always, thank you for watching. Drop any questions you have in the comments below. Hope you have a lovely day. Peace out.